hello guys in today's video i'll be showing you how to unlock your facebook account when you experience this learn more issue so first of all we are going to convert this learn more to get started and it's what i'll be taking you through up to the last point of you unlocking their facebook account successfully so you just have to follow me throughout this whole video without skipping and in case it's your first time don't forget to subscribe and also turn on the notification bell so that each time when i make a new video you'll always be among the first to watch so I'm going to take you through this uh, using uh, a PC, a desktop version, and then we shall be taking step by step. So without wasting any further time, let's begin. In most cases, if you experience this learn more issue, you're first going to click on learn more so that you're able to go to the next step of get started. So from here, I'm going to click learn more. So then under this, uh, where they say, I think my Facebook account was hacked. So you're going to scroll down and you select this option was was this helpful on your android phone or on your mobile phone it is it is shown when you scroll down so you're going to click no so under no they ask you what, what went wrong so the information is confusing the solution doesn't work so you're going to click on other you leave the first three and then you select the fourth one which is which says other so under that other, it is where you'll be able to write the description. I mean, you'll be able to describe the issue that you're experiencing. Here, they'll be asking you, can you say more? So this is where you're going to type what you're experiencing. You're going to just write to them this simple essay. And after that, you submit. So I'm going to put this in the description of the video so such that in case you also want to copy the same thing, you can just copy and paste. So after that, uh, you will have to wait for some hours for them to look through that and when you check back after some hours your that thing will be converted to get started so after submitting that essay that description you're going to check after some hours so after a few hours when you open you'll, you'll have this get started activated so then you click on it and then from here you're going to select next So this option will help you get to the point of unlocking the account so then you come to confirm your identity so even here you're just going to tap on it then under that uh, the same will walk you through a few steps add an email address and upload your id so you're going to get your email ready that email is what they will use for contacting you it is it is not necessarily the one you used for signing into your account it will just be an email address that they can use for contacting you especially uh, on approval that you've been granted access to your account so you're just going to enter the email that you're able to access so after putting the email you select continue and then from here you're going to upload your id so if you don't have an id you select this option of i don't have any of these and you'll upload some documents that are necessary so under the id it's either your national id birth certificate so then from here you'll choose and it'll take you to your root storage you will be able to select so after that you submit so on submission still you have to make sure that the id that you submit has the name or the face that is on your account so it should bear this the name or the face that is in your account so they will take some time to review and after still a few hours they will get back to you with an email confirming that uh, they have accepted and can give you access to your facebook account so this email will look like this so the email will look like this and it will contain either the link or the code that you'll use for accessing your account that code will be your password it will be the new password that you'll have to use in order for you to be able to access the account and probably change to the new password that you want so when you click on that link or when you enter those credentials your phone number uh, or the email using this code as the new password then you will be able to access your account so this is how it will be so this will be the next step after you confirming through the other link that they sent to you so you're going to click next and they will ask you to secure your login details so from here you, you're going to change the new password because they're saying it could be someone you used the other one for accessing your account so you're going to click on next so that it will take you to the step of setting a new password so you're going to click on next so here 
they will show you how to create a new password so you make sure that the password that you create it should contain a capital letter and then lowercase letter and also some figures so after that you're going to click on save changes save changes so you make sure that you don't forget your password again so you're going to write it somewhere so that you'll be using it next time when you need it so click save changes and these are your new login details so then you click next so from that step your account will be successfully unlocked so as you can see the account has, has, has successfully been unlocked so let me hope this video will help you and in case it does please don't forget to give a thumbs up and also you can drop a comment in the comment section to let me know if it has worked for you or you'd like another method so I hope to see you in the next video.